Web application client-side and server-side. Client-side scripting enables interaction within a web page. The code required to process user input is downloaded and compiled by the browser. Server is a web application server at a remote location that will process web requests and send pages to the client. How does client and server side work in web application? When a user goes to their browser and types in a website, the browser will search if the website exists. Then asks the server for the specific pages. The server reacts to the request by transferring some files over to the browser. The browser executes those files and shows something expectantly to the user. For example, when I try to log into this site called Matured Customer Login, the browser is going to make a request to the server and the server is going to respond back. So in order to go in detail, let me just click function F12, which opens up me the developer tools. I'm going to click network on this. I'm going to click on this particular website. It's called Matured Customer Login. So I'm going to click on this. The moment I click, I can see a request has been made on the right hand side. Let me just click on this Netshoot customer login. Now I got the response back from the server with a login page. So right now on the right hand side, I can see this customer login has been requested. The requested here was login page of Netshoot. And the response which I received from the server is HTML code. And the browser has executed that. I hope you guys have understood what is this client and server. So now we're going to talk about the different types of script in Netshoot. You see on the left hand side, there is a client script which executes on the client side. And there are a few more scripts like scheduled, map reduce, user event, which runs on the server side. Now, if I click on this Netshoot customer login page, I'm going to get a response back from the server. It was at this moment that he knew he fucked up.